What's up, guys? Chris and Dan show. How's it going out there in the interwebs? Welcome back. This is my buddy, Chris. He's over there with the headphones. He's over there chewing gum. He's like, he's ready for this. He can't wait to hear a yet another I hip hop sure song. Hope it was better. Let's hope. Let's hope it's better than yesterday. I can almost guarantee that. <laughs> yesterday, I was kind of pushing the envelope, but I knew it wasn't going to be good. This is, I almost guarantee you'll like it better than yesterday okay. with my okay. life, with my life on it. So I'm it'd be like confident. It would be like me playing uh, screaming, just straight screaming rock music for you. That's all I did was scream. Right. And then playing something semi that I like. But this okay. you might actually like. Who knows? Who all knows? Right. Let's see. Let's see. Today we're going to get into Jay-Z song Cry. So okay. my my rocker friend Chris Chris Sauber, here he is. He's going to tell us if he likes this. Yesterday I took notes. He said he wants redeeming qualities in his hip hop. So notes. Oh my god. Nutritious. You're serious about this. I took notes. <laughs> nutritious. Nutritious. So I found Jay-Z's most introspective song and okay. keeping consistent with your themes of girlfriend music or girls you know friend zoning and all this this is jay-z song where he opens up about his girlfriend it's not beyonce for those watching or for you asking See, it's I not it's about some girl that's special to him and or was in the past and um he's going back in time talking about it but talking to her it's like, I think you're going to like this one, man. I think so, you're going to like it. I would have expected from you, if you were going to try to mimic what the songs I'm playing for you, I would have expected something like Kanye West Gold Digger or something like that. Right, but you heard that one, and I already knew that. Yeah, and I like that one. Because that's entertaining. I know, yours, you either want redeeming qualities or humorous. Yeah. Or both. This is yeah. a redeeming quality part. Okay. All right, so let's get into it. I'm going to share... And we're all going to just listen. Um, Jay-Z's deep, man, especially this song. So we might have to rewind. I have Rap Genius. I could pull up Rap Genius. What is this? To... What is Rap Genius? You put in a lyric and it tells you what it means? It's like a... Yeah, Rap Genius will break down a song for you uh, and then explain, like, they'll dissect the deeper meanings of it and, like, oh. the slang if you need to. Okay. Interesting. If you need to, if you need to I have it ready. I did not know uh, something like this existed. Oh, yeah. Um, so I have it open if you need it. you know. But I think I'll be your tour guide on this. I think I can help most of it. But if we run into something I'm not sure, I'm happy to refer to Rap Genius. All right. Interesting. All right. I have it ready. So ready? Are you mm -hmm. excited? Here we go. Uh, yeah. I'm tingling with excitement. June 2002. <laughs> Nice so car. I should say this song came out in 2002. Nice car. So what that's, is that? That's a Ferrari. So let's go back. So this song came out in 2002. So at the time, this was a brand new uh, Ferrari. Okay. Looks similar to the modern day Corvette. Yeah. That's him and present day. This song goes back and forth at time. Watch. Sounds like a love song. Sounds like a love song. It is a love song. Most incredible, baby. See, the date changes, the car changes, but the person doesn't change, man. Yeah. See, he's yeah. a little lower in the car. Yeah. I can't see him coming down my eyes, so I gotta make the song cry. I can't see him coming down my eyes, so I gotta make the song cry. Good dude, I know you love me like cook food, even though it's Gotta move like a crook move We was together on the block since free lunch We should have been together having four seasons brunch We used to use umbrellas to face the bad weather So now we travel first class to change the forecast Never in bunches, just me and you I loved your point of view cause you held no punches Still I left you for months on end It's been months since I checked back in We're somewhere in a small town Somewhere locking them all down Wood grain, foreign change, armor raw down I can understand why you want a divorce now Though I can't let you know it Pride won't let me show it Pretend to be heroic That's just one to grow it But deep inside it So sick I can't see him coming See, so he, it's about divorce 
Um, I got that much so far. Yeah. So anything you need me to translate so far for the rap not, genius? Not thus far, but much, much better song than the two you did uh, last. I told, I knew, I knew. This is one of Jay Z's best. All right, here we go. Me down my eyes, so I gotta make the song cry. I can't see him coming down my eyes, so I gotta let the song cry. I can't see it coming down my eyes, so I gotta make the song cry. I can't see it coming down my eyes, so I gotta make the song cry. On repeat, the CD of Big me and my watching Barney and Clyde pretending to be that empty in your hand saying, Let me see that shopping sprees, pull out your visa quick. Had very bad credit, you helped me lease that whip. You helped me get the keys to that V.6. We were so happy, Paul, but when we got rich, it's when the signals got crossed and we got flipped. Rather mine, I don't know what made me leave that. Made me speed that quick. Let me see, that's it. It was the cheese. Help them get amnesia quick. I used to cut up their buddies. Now they're saying they love me. Huh? You need that translator, right? Uh, I don't know. Something about cheese. Was, yeah, so, uh, okay, let me read you. This is why I have rap genius. I think I'm going to go with this from now on with, <laughs> with these reactions. You helped me. So, a brother, instead of N-word, I'll say brother. A okay. brother had very bad credit. You helped me lease that. got that, that part. Right. Okay. She had good credit. She got everything yeah. you wanted. I got that. And then when they we, got rich, they yeah, hit problems. We, we were so happy poor, but when we got rich, that's when our signals got crossed and we got flipped. Yeah. Rather mine, I don't know what made me leave that shit, made me speed that quick. Let me see. That's it. It was the cheese. Yeah, I don't um, get that part. Money. It's slang for money. Oh, okay. It was All the right. cheese. Help them bitches get amnesia quick. So what does that so, mean? Well, let's translate with uh, Rep Genius, okay? So he's paying so, women off to help him cheat on his wife? Just no. Keep, they gotta no, no, keep no. Quiet? So here's what it says. Money is the source of these relationship problems. As soon as Jay started making serious money, uh, his romantic options opened up. So to cut up is to make a laugh or sleep with. Jay uses both meanings, exemplified by the rhetoric in Jigawatt. Uh, once he turned up in his 4.6 Range Rover, women forgot that Jay was the comedian or that he'd worked his way through their entire friendship group. A dubbed out buggy is a car on expensive rims. It's actually a Lexus. And I know better than this thing. Both parties experience amnesia. Jay's money has allowed him to upgrade the type of girl he's with. So when the old flames come calling, he's quick to shut the door on them. Got it. Okay. <laughs> Gotta love the internet. Used to tell a friend so was ugly and wouldn't touch me. Then I showed up in that dubbed out buggy. And then it got fuzzy and they don't remember that. And I don't remember you. I can't see it coming down my eyes. So I gotta make this song cry. I can't see it coming down my eyes. So I gotta make this song cry. Yeah, I've seen them coming down your eyes. But I gotta make this song cry. I can't see it coming down my eyes, so I gotta make the song cry. A face of stone was shocked on the other end of the phone. Word back home is that you had a special friend. So, so hang what on. was also oh special? So, yeah. uh, rap music seems to be a little bit, I don't know if misogynistic is the right word, probably not. But in the one that I like, the one with Eminem and Dr. Dre. Yeah. So at the end, Dr. Dre who's the angel tells tells him to shoot you know get the yeah. get the gun and shoot them both right 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 so where's her angel telling her to get the gun and go shooting people right is it because she's a female she's not allowed to be violent or what uh it's just a different kind of song you know it's not about guilty i'm conscience. more making a joke i understand i'm more making a joke oh, okay okay so <laughs> since we pause here at verse three a face of stone was shocked on the other end of the phone word back home is that you had a special friend Right, that's what he's saying about her. So let's. We so don't need rap she's cheating. for that. So yeah. she's cheating. Yeah, okay. yeah. Okay, let's go back to there. It's a good song. I like it. So I gotta make the song cry. A face of stone was shocked on the other end of the phone. Word back home is that you had a special friend. So what was oh so special then? You have given away without getting at me. That's your fault. How many times you've forgiven me? How was I to know that you was plain sick of me? I know the way 
living was whack She don't get it back like that I'm a man with pride, you don't do f- like that You don't just pick up and leave and leave me sick like that You don't throw away what we had, just like that I would just f- some girls, I was gonna get right back They say you can't turn a bad girl good But once a good girl's gone bad She's gone forever I'm on forever I gotta live with Do you agree with that? Once a once a good girl's gone bad, she's gone forever. No, not necessarily. I think I think he is being misogynistic now because he's saying I can <laughs> cheat on you as much as I yeah, want. Yeah, he's saying, uh, yeah, you don't get I me back on, like that. I can that. cheat on you as much as I want. You do it I'm, one time. I'm a man with pride. You, right. Yeah, I'm a man with pride. You don't do shit like that. You don't pick up and leave me, leave me sick like that. You don't throw away what we had just like that. I was just fucking those girls. I was going to get right back. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh, this dude's crazy, man. But the song. De- definite definite uh, womanizer. Yeah, this was 2002. Logic. You got to remember it was a little bit more oh, acceptable. Uh, sure. I'm sure nothing's changed in reality except for maybe saying these type of things. And I still think they do in rap songs, don't they? Yeah, they do. They do. They do. Yeah. But here, I don't it's think getting over. canceled is anything they worry about rap. No, they don't. All right, so it's almost <laughs> over. Here we go. Let's let's continue. I'm glad you like it way better. Some girls, I was gonna get right back. They say you can't <laughs> turn a bad girl good, but once a good girl's gone bad, she's gone, gone forever. forever. I'm on forever. I gotta live with the fact I did you wrong forever. I can't see them coming down my eyes, so I gotta make the song cry. I can't see him coming down my eyes, so I gotta let the song cry. I know I seen him coming down your eyes, but I gotta make the song cry. I can't see him coming down my eyes, so I gotta make the song cry. What's up, girl? Boom, boom. Boom, 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 boom. Boom, boom. Underrated beat. Underrated beat. And with the soul, I like the soul sample. I know you're not into soul, but I like it. I actually prefer the actual bells. Sounds like real bells, opposed Uh, to the synthesized beat. Okay. Yeah, it's an underrated beat, in my opinion. Like that synthesized beat? Let's just keep repeating. Yeah. I also like the actual singing. Yeah, the soul samples and stuff. Um, and the female. So what do you think, man? Definitely better. Definitely redeeming better. quality? It's not not cringe worthy in any way. But it's on the uh, it's on the uh redeeming quality sector, no? It, it probably helps your argument uh as far as that goes with it being um not dubbed, it's not dubbed, but being bleeped. Yeah. Uh. Because there was a whole bunch of, I don't know what he's saying, but it, uh, I can only figure, right, with the with the uh, no sound when he's nah, saying most something. Most of it is just N-words or F-word, basically, that's getting bleeped out, but, sure. and shit, they bleeped out shit. But you so, get the message. Sure. So, uh, yeah, I mean, it's much better. Um, probably back in the realm of a five and a half, six. Ah, strong score from Chris from the Russian but, judge. Yeah, I'm not Russian. <laughs> the Russian judge. <laughs> Russian judge got to he's but, get, coming around to it. It's going to be. It's really. See, I don't envy you because it's going to be really difficult for you to probably find a song I really like. I probably <laughs> already heard the ones that I really like. No, um, I don't think so. No. Okay. Yeah, because, I knew you wouldn't really like it, but I knew you wouldn't hate it. Uh, it's something about just talking in rap, right? I don't know. Yeah. It makes it, it's, it's like, I don't know. Don't know how to explain it. It's uh, not. Yeah. Like we said, like I said, like the first video, it's lesser music to me, right? Cause that's why I liked in this where I had the female, you know, with the, with the singing in the background. Yeah. I, mean, I like that. She had a nice voice, but uh, yeah, it's good. Beat. Yeah, and the beat was good too. Um, but redeeming quality. This is yeah, what you kept somewhat, saying yesterday. Somewhat. I mean, I don't know about redeeming necessarily. It just wasn't. Uh, well, the fact that he wasn't made a mistake, super negative. Yeah. He acknowledges that relationship after she's gone. And yeah, after both, she's gone. 
They're both responsible. Yeah. And he regrets what he did. Yeah. Yep. He learned his lesson. All right. So we got, we got, well, okay. So you wouldn't buy this though. No. You wouldn't wouldn't listen to it again. But it wouldn't bother me. Like if, you know, we're going out to Hazen's and, and you were playing this three times, it wouldn't bother me. Okay. We'd be like, man, pick another song. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Okay. All right. Good enough. So five and a half. Maybe six. Somewhere oh, okay. There. Six is good, man. Somewhere in there. All right. So I'm getting closer. Yeah. All right. Cool. Well, let us know, guys, what else Chris should react to in the comments. And, you know, he's difficult, but we'll get the Russian judge on our side. We'll turn double agent. I don't know where you're coming up with this Russian stuff, but sure. The Russian judge is the one that's always like everybody else puts eights. He puts two. Oh, yeah, you, know, you get a little that something, person. something. I got it. For, okay. Get KGB did, don't want that. Didn't know that the Russian judges did that. That that's the analogy or the metaphor. Okay. okay. All right, cool. So thank you guys. Subscribe, like, share, comment, and what Chris should watch next. Take care.